Katie, no matter what happens, realistically, you're going to be okay. Itch. And then we visit. Are you going to go on college business with us, Ryan? I what are you doing, Mike? <laughs> Girl, I don't know. I can't even sign my own papers legally. <laughs> like, for real. Come on. Like, you're going to ask me what I want to do? I don't know. Good afternoon, good afternoon, Katie. It's good to see you. It's good to see you. And what you it's been doing? A long time. It's been a while. It's since at least this morning. At least this morning. Yes. Nice. You know what? Sometimes I watch Joel and Leah. Remember we did it. Remember we did a clap. Yeah. We got to meet Joel and Leah in London. Sometimes I watch them just because I like to hear them talk. If you guys don't know Joel and Leah, go take a peek at Joel and Leah. They are from two people from. Oh, are you drinking satin, bird? Don't mind me, I was drinking my morning, my morning gel. In the afternoon, I, s I declare. 118. <laughs> it's not 118. No, it's 218. Thought, can someone fix that? Yeah, our electricity went out. Um, yes, I'll fix that. So what are you doing on the computer, Kate? What's got you going? Why don't you have a look? Oh. This is called Noviance. This is my college tracker slash... <laughs> for applications. For applications. Um, what are you doing, Mike? <laughs> Sorry, Kate. <laughs> I don't think I've ever. Heard, I don't think I've ever heard Dad um, talk in a fake accent, except for when he said Millie, like when we were. Oh, the right, 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 right. Mm -hmm. Give us your best English accent, Dad. Okay. <laughs> He's not good at an English accent. Hmm. Good night. Good night, Mike. <laughs> no, that's uh, that's Caddyshack. All right, anywho. All right, so you so are I'm applying to colleges right now. Applying I to have colleges. already applied to, let me tell you, App State, which for those of you who don't go to America, um, <laughs> that's um, a college in North Carolina. Appalachian State University. Appalachian State University. Appalachian. So the, okay, yeah. I'm, so, I'm telling them, okay, so I, yeah. I just for the people that don't like live, don't go to America. Um, yeah, right. I'm going to start saying that. Do you go to America? <laughs> um, the, these are just like the college. I'll tell you the college and where they are. Except some of them, actually most of them are self-explanatory. Self right? um, I haven't yet applied to college of Charleston, but I'm in the, in the process now. That's also in um, South Carolina. Which is different from Appalachian. Which is different which from North Carolina. Carolina. The Carolinas, they're all kind of the same. Um, Florida Atlantic University. I have not yet applied there, but I'm in the process of it. That's in Florida. Uh, Florida Southern College, which I have not applied to yet, but I'm in the process of it. Um, this one's in Texas. Um, Florida State University. That was a joke. Why didn't you laugh? Oh, I thought, I thought you were talking about Texas, um, um, SMU. <laughs> No. Oh, Florida State University is not in Texas. The Florida I Florida Southern was in Texas. Oh, sorry. Wow. No, because I I don't know. I was just okay. Florida State though is where Brennan goes. Florida State's where Brennan goes. Um, I have submitted my app. Cool shoes. Thank you. Uh -huh. I have submitted submitted my application for Florida State. I have submitted my application for UF. University of Florida. University of Florida, and if you guys don't know, University of Florida and Florida State are rival schools. If you haven't seen, we just went to that football game. So you should watch Take that. It would be a little bit of cause a little bit of turmoil. It would okay. cause a little bit of turmoil. Cause a bit of turmoil. Among your brother. It's all Among good. my brother and my other brother. Because Ryan now is like a big Florida State fan. Mr. Florida State. Yeah. Because of Brennan. But so he would be bad. But you know. That's okay. That'd be cute. Mom would be can adorable. Mom could get a sweatshirt that's like half like patchwork, like half Florida State, half UF. Right. And maybe like a little tornado of emotions. Anyways. Exactly. <laughs> so University of Florida, I have applied to there. Um, University of South Carolina, Columbia, have not applied there yet, but I'm in the process. So I'm, a, I'm applying to all these colleges. I've either turned in my application or I'm working on my application. So that's mm -hmm. what that means. That's kind of mm -hmm. confusing. Mm -hmm. um, University of South Florida. I haven't, I haven't submitted my application there. Yes, I have? Yes, oh, USF, USF. Yeah, oh. Yeah, yeah, yeah. See, uh -huh. USF in my head is like, oh, USF, University of South Florida, Maine Sounds campus. so I'm different. Like, what is that? Right. No, I have applied to USF. Mm -hmm. um, University of Tampa. Wow, I have submitted more than I thought I have. Yeah. University of Tampa, I have applied to, um, which is in Florida. All of these have been in Florida so far, except for South Carolina uh, and App State. App State. 
in Charleston. Um, TCU, I'm not applying there anymore, am I? Texas Christian, no. Yeah. I don't that was I, on the list, but now it's not on the list. Now it's not on the list. It's too far. Um, I'd like to be close to my mommy. Yes. Um, and wait, are those? Is, did you add the other two? Yeah, yeah. Add the other two. Florida Southern. Nice. So that's it. Mm-hmm. So far. Oh, and the academies. Right. Yeah. Oh. So that's exciting. Oh, you okay? Ah. So Katie, so we had a discussion um, a while ago about how it was a little bit overwhelming and you sort of decided at that point that you would open your options, right? There's a lot of different things that you could be doing. So she's trying to think, she thought she was going to go to school for maybe law, but now what are you thinking? Well, here's the thing. I have no clue. I don't know what I want to do. I'm 17 years old. Realistically, I'm only like an eighth, not even an eighth through my life. Actually, maybe an eighth. <laughs> You're not going to be 160. Yeah, but I don't maybe. think I'm going to be Yeah, I mean, you could. I could. I could. Um, wow, an eighth of my life? That's really frustrating. An eighth? What kind of story? You're more than an eighth. I'm like a seventh? A sixth? I'm be six. I don't know, 20, 100. You're going to live to be 120? Uh, okay. okay. All right. Anyway, that's not. That, that's not. Yes, exactly. You're just young to know what you want to do for the rest of your life. Yeah, and like it's weird that they expect people to know what they want to do for the rest of their life when you're not even an adult. Like yeah. I will graduate high school as a 17 year old, a minor, a right. minor. Like I have no clue. I can't even live on my own. I can't even sign my own papers. And they're like, "Oh, what do you want to do for the rest of your life?" Exactly. So my key, like my head, where my head is at the moment is either, which this could, I mean, not yeah. either, or just the no. options. One yeah. of the options, community college. Fantastic community college by our house in Florida. And first of all, it would be a fantastic idea financially because mm-hmm. it's significantly less expensive than going to a state college mm-hmm. or private college. Mm-hmm. Um, and it gives me, and in that time, I can complete all of the dumb credits that you need to have to graduate college like health yeah and like prerequisites all that like, yeah or, all the, not pre- the, like, the gen ed uh, courses like, yeah yeah gen ed courses which would be fantastic to do at a community college because it's less expensive and then i could go to and then i could transfer to a four-year college a state college if i'd like to do that because then maybe How, you'd know what you want because do then maybe i'd know what i want to do by then to. which would yeah yeah um or i could go to a state college or I could go to a private college. So, I mean, that's I, an option. I was actually asking you about what you think you might want to study. No, I know. I know. Oh, okay. but oh this, I see. Oh, I see. Oh, thing. okay, okay, okay. It's all, it's all part of the thing. So, we're going to call this story time with Kate. Yes. So, college story time. College story time. Mm-hmm. Like first of all, I'd like to remind everyone to not stress about college. There you go. That's my girl. And I've been stressing about it a lot recently. Which, you know, as a 17-year-old... People are always asking you the question, where are you going to go to college? Girl, I don't know. I can't even sign my own papers legally. Like, for real. Come on. Like, you're going to ask me what I want to do? I don't know. So, don't stress. Uh, good, not even good friend. A boyfriend of mine once said, <laughs> Katie, no matter what happens, realistically, you're going to be okay. That's Which right. is true because right. no matter what happens, you're on your happens, own timeline. Not you're on your own timeline. timeline. Who who's in a rush? You know who right. who's in a rush? Right. And you know, realistically, your parents want you to do something. That's great, but it's your life. You know, mm-hmm. your teacher is pushing you to do something. Fantastic, but they're a teacher. You're a different person. You know, guidance has, counselors, guidance counselors, society, guidance counselors are constantly pushing people to take. Five APs because that's what you need to do. No, they just want their school and I'm to sure have they, higher ratings. Right. And I'm, and sure I'm sure they're, they're looking out for you, but yes, right. But come on. Like, we're not in that rat race. There's a big rat race going on. We're not running that rat race. We're, we're chilling. That's right. We have options. Don't even, don't even not go to college. We know so many people, very successful people, beautiful families, living the life, didn't even go to college. You know? So there's plenty of options for everyone out there. And I want you to know if there's people... If there's people that are pushing you to go to college and, um, and maybe that's not the direction you want to take, I've got your back. At least, you know, someone out there has, I mean, I've got your back realistically, you know? Okay. So like, if you're like, oh, everyone wants me to go to college, but I don't even know. I have your back. 
And it doesn't mean like, if you don't go right away that you it won't ever go. Right, exactly. Like, pe- I mean, people go to college in their 40s to, like, finish their, like, majors. People right. do that all the time. Like, there's, I mean, there's so many options. And, like, they, they and there's so many people that go out and, after, co- after high school and they go get a job. And they work that job for a few years and they realize, oh, I really like this or I don't like this. And then their job pays for them to go to college. Mm-hmm. <laughs> right? To, or, like, or they yeah. start out at a job that doesn't require any certain major. Mm-hmm. And then they want to advance in that job. And then they're like, oh, well, if I go take this class, that I can advance higher up the workforce. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So there's plenty of options. Don't mm-hmm. stress about it. It's not that deep. I mean, and, you know, it's not that deep. It's, it's just not that deep because because um, I said so. <laughs> so. <laughs> but we just don't want to be, like, laying around watching movies all day long. Oh, no. That's, that's not productive. We want to be productive in whatever you're doing. Absolutely. Moving forward at some point. Sometimes you're stagnant, but that's okay as long as you... And as long as you're healthy and getting your mind together. Realistically, God has a plan no matter what. So as long as you, God helps people who help themselves. Mm-hmm. So as long as you're helping yourself and not looking for people to do things for you, you'll be fine. Mm-hmm. You'll be good. I also believe it's good to Just put your best foot forward. To use the, your God-given talents to to do something to, to better, better the world, better you, better Society. whatever. Yeah, exactly. Anyway, so that so being back said, to question, back to the question <laughs> of what I'd like to major in. Um, one of my interests is I know, I know, I roll nursing. Okay, I'd be a fantastic nurse. Why I is that I roll? Them. Because everyone's like, oh, all the popular girls in high, in high school go and they become nurses, and they like did it. Really? Like, yeah. Oh, I and it's like that. a thing that people oh. like. Oh no, I think you'd be an amazing nurse. Yeah, and I, I don't really like that. It's kind of rude. I'm like, why would you judge people for like wanting to do what they want to do? Right. It's kind of crazy. Okay. Like, people do. Anyway, so nursing, one of the things. Um, pediatrician. I, everything that I want to do medical related has to do with kids. Mm-hmm. So like, um, you know, mm-hmm. pediatrics, everything. Nursing, maybe. I don't know. Nurse practitioner, doctor, maybe. I don't know. Dentistry. I was getting there. <laughs> Dentistry is another branch off the medical tree. I can't get my boot up. Um, and <laughs> I don't know why you're laughing at me. Sorry. Dentistry. Pediatric dentistry. Kids. Love kids. I want to walk in every day to my practice wearing scrubs that are a different color with like monkeys on them or something. <laughs> Actually, if I was like, if I was actually, if I was a dentist, like not like, what are the assistants called? Like the dental assistants. A dental assistant? Oh, not one of those. I want to be an actual dentist. Yeah. Like the doctor. Yes. Like it's like Dr. Katie's office. Yes. It wouldn't be Katie, it'd be Dr. Carolyn's office. And I'd be oh. Like, oh, yeah. Oh, oh. What did you say? What? <laughs> oh, I'm Dr. Carolyn. <laughs> oh. missed that. Oh, that's Katie's last name. Interesting. Okay. Go ahead. So, and then I'd be like, oh. Yeah, that's me. You know, like when they right. answer and they go, hello, this is... Dr. Donnelly. Dr. 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 Donnelly. Dr. Donnelly. Teaching Dr. Donnelly. Yeah, that'd be right. me. Except it wouldn't be like that because... Right, it's, that, it's not that It's big. not that urgent. It'd be like, there's a comedy! <laughs> <laughs> it wouldn't be like that. But, yeah, I love kids. And um, dentistry, uh, great, great career path. Um, you don't have to cut anyone open. Yeah. It's less expensive than the, like, what, eight-year medical school that you have to go through to be... Whatever, whatever. I mean, I guess I still have to do it if I was going to be a doctor. Are you still interested in law at all? Yes. But it's expensive. Mm-hmm. And I don't know if I could see myself doing that for the rest of my life. Mm-hmm. Unless it was, like, some sort of, like, fun, like, thing, mm-hmm. you know? Mm-hmm. But I feel like every time I think of law, it's just, like... Like, I like it. I like, like, the... Mm-hmm. Study of it. The and study of it and, like, the justice and mm-hmm. all that. Except when I think about law, I think about... An ugly brown office, yeah, with a bunch of books. Yeah, I'm like that just is not my stuff. Yeah. I'm, I'm too no. much yeah. for that, you know. Right. But I do like law, so maybe I do like a like a little like I'll I'll dabble in law. Okay. <laughs> I'll be a lawyer, lawyer, dentist, nurse practitioner. practitioner. Perfect. Um, so that's another thing. Law, kind of like itch in the back of my head. Don't know. Another thing, interior design. Maybe I want to renovate houses with my mom. I don't know. Maybe I want to start a business. I don't know. know. What about sign language? What about sign language? Do you think you'd ever have a career or a a position or a job that related to sign language? I don't know. It's very expensive to get your... I mean, it's less expensive than, like, 
go to college. But um, but you could be known as the pediatric dentist like that signs. You could be really, really good with like special education kids or like special ed, yeah. And you're really just very gentle and caring and relatable. I am. Okay. Mm. Mm. Humble too. <laughs> One of my greatest qualities. <laughs> All right, so let's get to let's get to applying. Let's get to let's get to making this life uh, happen. What life? The life that you're speaking of. Well, I've taken you many lives. So. I know. Well, let's we can start the ball rolling. All and right. it's going to be somewhere in Florida, guys. Okay. <laughs> so, I'm going to be a tan queen. <laughs> um, All right. How can I help you? Also, oh, I forgot to say this. This is we've been talking about a lot about like the studying and life kind of thing. Um, I'd like to say I would love to be a college cheerleader. Mm-hmm. Um, that's it. Okay. I'd love to be a college cheerleader. I like for some reason. I'm like, I never really liked cheer as much as I have this year. You know what I'm saying? Like, mm-hmm. it was always kind of like, oh, yeah, like, I cheer for my high school. Like, I'm an ex-gymnast. Like, I'm too cool for I'm too cool for cheerleading. But it's not like that. It's like, I really, really enjoy it. Like, I truly enjoy stunting and tumbling and being with a team. Mm-hmm. And, like, being the positive one. You mm-hmm, know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm, mm-hmm, and mm-hmm. it's like, you can't, like... I don't know. Yeah. I like so, it. I like putting on my uniform and having a bow in my hair, which if you were to show this video to fifth grade Katie, she'd probably throw up. Actually, she wouldn't throw up because she's, she was scared of throwing up. Right. So, <laughs> but she used to make fun of people with bows in their hairs. But I just because that was a gymnast thing. It's, it's, and no yeah. offense to all those yeah. people who yeah. do. But now Kate's like, oh, yeah. Now, and I'm like up. looking at these tumbling requirements for like some of the colleges. I'm like, I can't like I could do that. Yeah. You know? Yeah. Good for you. So I just wanted to tell you guys that that might be in my... In your future. In my future. That's and you guys will get some, some nice cheerleader content. Oh. Ah, that'd be so fun. All right, comment down below if you guys have any suggestions for Kate on the schools that she mentioned or any college advice, anything like that, any post-high school advice. We'll check back in with you a little later today. Remember, guys, it's not that deep. Hi, Alice. Do you want to come sit on my app? Katie, um... <laughs> is doing college application and she just had a couple more done you're gonna be done soon Dang. i know you and know then she... we just sit and wait yeah. and then we visit are you gonna go on college business with us ryan that'd be so he'll be rying in hell because he hasn't gotten <laughs> <laughs> he hasn't learned about god, god, god yet he's supposed to be doing his confirmation <laughs> stuff and he's not He's sitting here with my until you started videoing. Oh, you did? Oh, I'm sorry. Okay, I'll let, I'll let him go. It's my fault, Michael. I'll let him no, go. Yeah, yeah. Um, you. No, what? Uh, Katie applied to like every school in Florida. Mm-hmm. So mm-hmm. if she goes to school, she'll be going to school. In the It'll be a nice place to, nice, when we do, do, do the college visits, you can come with us and yeah, do a little yeah. tour of Florida. All right, it's officially cold up here. I've got my blanket on. Alice is sitting in front of the heater. <laughs> it's cold when they can't, actually... Hey, she wants to play. She like really hurts when she plays. She's serious. I mean, as cute as she is, she's a serious kitty. Aren't you, buddy? I don't I don't know if she's like mad or if she's actually trying to play. Well, she's probably like, stop petting me because I was just laying here and you keep touching me all the time. Maybe that's She want ah <laughs> She wants attention all the time. I, I know, know she does. All right, Katie, Katie, what made you happy today, baby girl? Your head against me. No. I will say we are all kind of exhausted. I don't even want to turn the camera around on me because I look atrocious. Everyone in the family is just like not. Well, not it's right we had a long like actually had a great week in Florida, but then everyone like traveling is catching up to us. So Ryan went to bed early. Mike went to bed early. I'm about to go to bed. Katie just finished her homework. Did you finish your homework? I finished tons of college application work. That's right. Tons of depop work stuff. Right. And tons. Of homework. Of homework. Math work, probably. I'm on a roll. I you are. I deserve the best night's sleep. Yes. I've ever had. Well, let's go do it. Let's go sleep. Okay. We've got a lot coming up too. Christmas decorating and Christmas tree getting and before you know it, Christmas Brendan will be here. Christmas shopping, Christmas cookie making. We have a lot to a lot to do. Did you yeah. film your um, Christmas cookies yesterday? No. <gasps> Katie made the most beautiful sugar cookies. All right, what made you happy, sweet, sweets? Oh, I'm sorry, Alice. Oh, um, getting all my work done. Congratulations. I did a lot of work. You did do a lot of work. Very proud of myself. I have to agree. 
what made me happy today was like sitting down with Kate and getting tons of stuff done. Congratulations! It's very exciting. All right, you guys. Kate, can you shake us out? Oh, what did she see? Comment below, made you happy today. And we'll see you tomorrow. Comment below, made you happy today. We'll see you tomorrow. Is it better? It's boring. <laughs> it's boring. For the latest in Live Happy and It's the Donnelly's merchandise, visit shopitsthedonnelly's.com. Thanks for watching. Be sure to thumbs up and subscribe. See you later.